Singapore has all its value uh, investment in education. We think that education is always the start of our talent development, which is critical for any uh, national development. So if you look at Singapore from the early days of our nationhood, our investment in uh, education is paramount. And we like to uh, pride ourselves that today we have a very, very strong educational ecosystem with universities are globally competitive. Then follows investment in science and technology. And that is a belief that science and technology will propel our country in terms of our national development, economically, but also the applications of science and technology to address our existential issues. So we, as a small country, our investment in science and technology only started seriously in 1991. It's only a 30 year journey. In the early days, I would say, you know, a focus of our funding were primarily applied science. And the reason because it is driven by our economic narrative. Uh, in the early days, I would say that, you know, the focus was also on the physical sciences. And that relates to the economic structure in Singapore. Uh, this started in 1991 with about $2 billion of investment over five years. Over time, I would say that, you know, our shift has been towards the basic sciences as we realize that investment in basic science is required for us to stay the journey to ensure that we are able to build a much more comprehensive knowledge ecosystem uh, as we are in our six five-year plan or seven five-year plan we have a budget of about five billion singapore dollars a year of which we are making sure that at least 30 percent of our research funding is for the basic sciences